the 2019 Wyoming Inauguration Gala is completely sold out. This Day in the Life video shows what it's like to be a one-woman crew when filming and reporting for CBS News Channel 5 at a big event. Well, actually, big event doesn't sufficiently describe Wyoming's Inauguration Gala. Little America was completely at capacity, with multiple ballrooms filled wall-to-wall -wall with people. When attending a gala, most women carefully pick out their accessories. But since I film, write, edit, and appear in my stories, my accessories were a tripod and a lot of camera equipment, along with my fancy dress. One of my biggest challenges was getting footage of the governor on stage. There were people literally everywhere excitedly cheering and absolutely no room for my camera and tripod. Fortunately, Governor Gordon's cameraman was kind enough to let me share the platform that he was standing on. Then came the next challenge, climbing up onto it while wearing heels and carrying heavy equipment. In between reporting live, I was shooting footage for my stories. CNN news source had asked for content. So in a situation like this, where there was a lot of commotion and a lot of work to be done, I knew I had to be prepared and know about our new governor in detail before the event. That way I could film a stand-up or do a live cut-in at any moment. Since I anchored the news the weekend before, I used that time to create some stories about Gordon and learn more about him. Now I'm joined by local author and Gordon supporter, Tina Ann Forkner. Thank you for joining us. Hi, Catherine. Thanks for having me. Now, what is the number one quality that drew you to Gordon? Though it definitely was a busy night and a challenge, it was worth it. I love seeing so much of our community at the event and our officials welcoming in the new administration. Here's one of my stories. The 2019 Wyoming Inauguration Gala is completely sold out, with residents talking about why they are looking forward to having Gordon be our governor. I'm really excited that Mark Gordon is going to be our governor. He's so knowledgeable economically. I think that he's really going to lead Wyoming in the right direction financially. I'm excited to see what he does for business, specifically small business. As treasurer, Gordon grew the state's portfolio by $5 billion. He has worked with investment pools that have allowed local government to better leverage their funds. And he has also been an advocate for local government on the state loan and investment board. Many residents believe Gordon's past work will reflect in the way he leads Wyoming as governor. His solid understanding of what our financial needs are and how to keep us going with strong stability um, for our economic future is sound. God bless you. God bless the United States. Let's have some fun. Again, this event is completely sold out. In fact, multiple rooms are being occupied. In Cheyenne, Catherine Chloe Cahoon, CBS News Channel 5.